The silicon band gap temperature sensor is an extremely common form of temperature sensor thermometer used in electronic equipment. Its main advantage is that it can be included in a silicon integrated circuit at very low cost. The principle of the sensor is that the forward voltage of a silicon diode, which may be the base emitter junction of a bipolar junction transistor BJT, is temperature dependent, according to the following equation V B E equals V G zero one minus T T zero plus V B E zero T T zero plus N K T Q lane T zero T plus K T Q lane I C I C zero Display style v underscore b equals v underscore g zero left one frac t t underscore zero right plus v underscore b e zero left frac t t underscore zero right plus left frac n k t q right lane left frac t underscore zero t right plus left frac k t q right lane left frac i underscore c i underscore c o right where T equals temperature in Kelvins, T0 equals reference temperature, VG0 equals bandgap voltage at absolute zero, VBE0 equals junction voltage at temperature T0 and current IC0, K equals Boltzmann's constant, Q equals charge on an electron, N equals a device dependent constant. By comparing the voltages of two junctions at the same temperature, but at two different currents, IC1 and IC2, many of the variables in the above equation can be eliminated, resulting in the relationship delta V B E equals K T Q lane I C one I C two Display style delta five underscore B equals frac K T Q C D O T lane left frac I underscore C one I underscore C two right Note that the junction voltage is a function of current density, i.e. Current, junction area, and a similar output voltage can be obtained by operating the two junctions at the same current, if one is of a different area to the other. A circuit that forces IC1 and IC2 to have a fixed N, 1 ratio gives the relationship delta V B E equals K T Q lane N display style delta five underscore B equals frac K T Q C D O T lane left N right. An electronic circuit, such as the Brokaw bandgap reference, that measures delta V B E can therefore be used to calculate the temperature of the diode. The result remains valid up to about 200 degrees Celsius to 250 degrees Celsius, when leakage currents become large enough to corrupt the measurement. Above these temperatures, materials such as silicon carbide can be used instead of silicon. The voltage difference between two PN junctions e.g. diodes, operated at different current densities, is proportional to absolute temperature PTAT. P 
PTAT circuits using either BJT or CMOS transistors are widely used in temperature sensors where we want the output to vary with temperature, and also in bandgap voltage references and other temperature compensating circuits where we want the same output at every temperature. If high precision is not required it is enough to bias a diode with any constant low current and use its minus 2 mV, C thermal coefficient for temperature calculation, however this requires calibration for each diode type. This method is common in monolithic temperature sensors. <laughs> 